all right guys so we are still updating what is going on what is trending in nigeria greetings to you and a happy weekend to you all i have this uh, quick interview wiki has finally been exposed uh an interview with mr ikenga is a member of uh, pdp uh of course we are already away what is going on in pdp yesterday i updated you guys that um the acting national chairman that is loyal to wiki a party chairman loyal to one single person that is loyal to wiki was suspended by the national working uh, committee uh, because of anti-party activity alongside with the national secretary you understand and it was linked to what happened in river state how uh can um you know in his watch 26 or 27 river state house of assembly member defected from uh, pdp to apc under his watch under wiki's watch you understand and nothing has been you know done about it and then the wiki on the other hand keep threatening literally almost everybody in pdp as if he's the one that owned pdp why because the national chairman of pdp is loyal to him and finally they are looking for a way to get at weekend now before they can get at weekend they need to break that wings that is covering weekend all right so now that everyone all the pdp members are celebrating that damagun has been suspended imagine dino milaye is happy uh fire she is happy almost all the pdp chief then they are happy because he's the reason why we can keep you know having this shield having this boldness that nothing nobody can suspend him in pdp all right so they are looking at a way to get back at wiki and before they do that they really need to step them and down and after after that uh, suspension they now run to court to get a court injunction these are the people that are benefiting from judiciary and these are the things people are complaining about nigerian judiciary they now have to run to court get a court injunction not to uh, suspend him until 2025 imagine no wonder we can keep uh, during an interview with the channel's television that the only way he can make peace with uh, uh fubra is for him to obey court order because maybe he knows that court order will always favor him. Now, let me allow you to listen to what Mr. Ikenga have to say. Then I will come back and give you the rest of my own personal opinion. The, the art of betrayal that the city minister has been carrying against the party for the last one year was possible because he had a national chairman, an acting national chairman, and secretary, and some few others who have been politically compromised. Sure, they are like PA and agents of the minister who is working in an APC government. They take instruction from That is why it was so difficult. You can imagine for the national chairman of the party to go as far as handed, there was a court order for them to do a state congress in Rivers. But he went ahead and did that state congress. And the supporters of the city minister were dashed the structures of the party. And these are people who have already played their allegiance to the APC agenda of winning in 2027. So it is so painful that the national chairman sits in a meeting encourages people who have vowed that their party cannot win election at the next general election. And in return, they are not keeping him in office with all those expert applications flying from one court or the other. And again, you need to understand, what are we fighting over? Article 45 said, if there is a vacancy, the deputy chairman emerges. And then there will be a neck meeting under Article 47, which mandates, shall is the word there, appoint an acting chairman from the zone or area where the former occupants originated. Now, all of a sudden, people are not going to court, looking for an injunction that will not say and a deputy national chairman can contribute to be a national chairman till 2025, 2026. So these are the things that have brought us to this point. All right, guys. So this has been the complaint of everyone in PDP, all the PDP chieftains, even the founding fathers, that keep saying that Wiki came to meet them in PDP. Wiki came and meet people in PDP. But now Wiki is carrying PDP on his head as if he's the one that formed the party. Why? Because the national chairman has refused to take decisive, uh, you know, decision, action against his anti-party uh, activity. Now, it would have been understood, or it is understood, that Wike needed a South-South president. That was the reason why he supported uh, APC, supported Tinibu, not supporting Atiku Abubakar because of power rotation. Fine. 
But what happened in Edo State where Wike was seen openly supporting the uh, APC, Adam Zoshumule, against Obaseke that is in PDP. Even when other PDP chieftain, I think Wabubaka was there, Simfubra was there, other PDP chieftain, they were there to support uh, this person, uh, uh, Obaseke, and PDP in the Edo State election. They just concluded Edo State election. But Wike was there openly supporting Adam Zoshumule of APC an APC governorship candidate in a do state. What happened? Was that not anti-party activity? It was. What did the chairman do? Uh, did about it? Nothing. Now, what about the, the wicked that is uh, talking about obeying of court order, court judgment? Now, what happened to the Congress in River State? Even when there was a court injunction, you understand? PDP Congress should not be held in River State. But guess what? The same wicked that is talking about FUBRA disobeying court order went ahead and hold that a PDP Congress where he, elect, he elected some uh, members, some officials uh, during that Congress. What happened? Was there no court injunction? Was there no court order? Did he obey it? But wicked now on national television is now saying the only thing that will make him have peace with him, Fubra, is for Fubra to obey court judgment. Now it looks as if court orders, court judgment, court injunction seems to favor some people and seems not to favor others. Now you ask yourself, this is the affairs of River State. Are you saying we don't have a high court in River State? Why will High Court in Abuja always the court that issues all this court injunction? Don't forget, uh, Wike is the F FCC minister. Yes. Why is it that all the cases that involve Wike, it is usually you know, coming from a federal high court in Abuja? Is it that there is no federal high court in the River State or what? Why not federal high court in River State? Why not state high court in River State? Why is it usually always federal high court in Abuja? So Ikenga here has exposed Wike. The reason why Wike was having all those morals in PDP was because even the national chairman was taking instructions from him. The national secretary was taking instructions from him. So literally that would give APC upper hand to manipulate PDP, that is what it means. All right, guys, let me know what you guys think. I quickly wanted to share that with you. Let me know what you think on the comment section below. See you in another update.